Hey guys, it's called Bambi TV. So today we're gonna be reacting to this. Wow. Guys, we're gonna be reacting to Anna the Dark Panther because I buy something for Apple and Apple. I think it's cool. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Are you saying? Are you saying, sir, that Mr. Dida's reference to the section relating to alcohol? was quoted out of context. Is that what you were saying? Said he gives a one-sided view of what the scripture is. Do you want him now to explain why it was contextual and not out of context? Well, is is that your question? No, I'm just taking him up on the point that he has spoken, right? What I want this audience to know that there's a balance view of the scriptures. And yes, but I'm we are not interested in statements. We have invited people to engage in a debate with Mr. Dillon. And you could very well have done so. But you're now asking a question. It is therefore his right to address your question. Uh, Mr. Dirad, the reference which you made to alcohol, the questioner said is that it was quoted out of context. The context. Let him read the context. Why read chapter 20 when the chapter is 31? The context, the context is the text that goes with it, before or after. I'm sure you understand simple English. The context is the text that goes with it, not chapter 20, not chapter 1, not book of Genesis. The context. Verse 5, verse 4, verse 3, verse 2, verse 1. Read it in the context. Okay. Verse 4 on through to 6, chapter 13. It is not for kings, O Lamuel. It is not for kings to drink wine, nor for princes strong drink. Lest they drink and forget the law and pervert judgment, or pervert judgment of any of the afflicted. Give strong drink unto him that is ready to perish, and wine unto those that be heavy of heart. Let him drink and forget his poverty and remember his misery no more. Right, right, you have done it. You have done it. Yes. Yes. It's, it's, it's telling you that the words of King Lemuel, the utterance which his mother taught him, what, my son, and what, son of my womb, and what, son of my vows, do not give strength to women, nor your ways to that which destroys kings. It is not for kings, it is not for kings, the rulers, or Lemuel, it is not for kings to drink wine. But the kings must be sober, the kings, the rulers, they must remain sober. The white man in Africa, he must remain sober. The American in America, in Canada, in Australia, the, 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 the Australian rulers of Australia, they must remain sober. Listen, it is not for kings, means rulers, or Lemuel, it is not for kings to drink wine, nor for prince intoxicating drinks, lest they drink and forget the law. Lest they drink, they are to rule. They mustn't drink. Very good. Good advice. Now, now, verse 6, and give strong drink to him who is perishing. Look, you rulers, you mustn't drink. You're going to rule. How are you going to rule if you are drunk? You mustn't drink, but now you give to those who are perishing, give them, look, this is in the context, I'm reading in the context, give strong drink to him who is perishing, and wine to those who are bitter of heart, let him drink and forget his poverty, and remember his misery no more. That is what they're doing in, in South Africa, the black man, in, in Canada, the Red Indian, in America, the Red Indian, the Aborigines of Australia, in, in India, this is what is happening. Thank you. 
looked like with the same thing goes for the Quran as well that if you have one more thing to talk about. So per what I'm saying here, you can can say to the guys you're trying to say that some people see them going to buy the newspaper and then why do who wants to sell it? I'm not really I'm not really sure you said something about it now. Who wants to sell it and that is a strong thing for it, something yeah. like that. So I don't really get the whole point of the argument, but then I just say the Bible shouldn't at all would not advise you to drink alcohol. I didn't say wine specifically because there are some wine, you went to the carriage with wine and alcohol because you want alcohol, but it just doesn't make any sense to buy alcohol and send that to you. Yeah. So I don't think the Bible would advise you to drink alcohol. Okay. Okay. Um, I don't really think that the answer the Bible is trying to be different. The Bible is one way you wouldn't, it's not long for story. You, you, you can't just go back and say you understand everything in the Bible. You wouldn't understand. And understanding comes from God. And understand, understand, for you to understand the Bible, even most pastors read the Bible, they don't fully really understand. They go to God to give them understanding. Some things are very deep. You can't debate about the Bible. Some Muslims will come and tell you this and this is what is in the Bible. It is not true. You see? So if you are going to debate with them, it will be like you are what they are saying is true. Well, but Bible. you wouldn't get you you don't read if you don't have understanding of the Bible, you can't interpret it to other people. Okay, so yeah. that I understand that. But then the Bible was written by men. They were written by men, but exactly. they it was God divine. Is, yes, God is the one who gave it to them to write. So you are trying to tell me that the people who wrote the Bible don't understand what they wrote. It's not like they don't understand what they wrote. We are humans. We don't. We, they are written. They are not here to tell us this is what I meant. Okay. You understand? They are not here to tell us that this is what I meant. So it is. It is not for us. You, you see, as the man was stranded over there, he didn't know what to say again. He didn't know what the one was mm-hmm. trying to tell. Like if I that's why I said this is wrong. He said yes. Let's bear let's bear this for those who are perishing. It says this from the unto him that is ready to perish. Yes, you are you, you see, are and here yeah, it's saying this thing um give bear for those who are perishing. It's two different things. Because the guy the guy said this strong drink unto him that is ready to perish, but I mean, that just trapped that off and said, not like I'm supporting Amen. Not like I'm like supporting, supporting Amen to that God. We are not saying, so like he changed we are not saying it. that I'm not, you are supporting. I'm, I'm not saying, relax, relax. <laughs> Obviously, you have different opinions about this. So, you know the Bible has different versions, right? Yeah. So, you are probably reading from the same source. Yeah. I do not know the version Amen to that is given to that. But then, I want to believe that he is talking based on what he wrote. I'm not saying. I don't think it won't be right to just accuse him outrightly. No. We are that, not accusing him. That's what I'm saying. saying is that you can't it, challenge it, the Bible. Okay. If the man says this song is also saying that he's ready to tell According to him. His Bible. His but, Bible. But I mean, did that just say this song is to those who are very Because if you, don't, if you want to be honest, for you forgot to say this song is to those who are very So it's. Those who are ready to tell it, not just those who are there. If you want to tell it, take it from them. I don't feel most of the time I'm trying to do things like that. Right? Don't really do that. Just like, just like, I'm trying to tell about 